Let's shift our focus to Pakistan now, where a lot is happening in months before the general elections. Former Prime Minister Imran Khan has stepped down from his party chairperson post, but his troubles do not seem to end. More coming up in our next report. Pakistan has officially entered election season, but with a February 8th polling date. A Pakistan election without Imran Khan or his party would be incomplete, in a first since his arrest following his conviction on the 5th of August. Imran Khan spoke to members of the press at Rawalpindi's Adiala prison. Imran Khan is facing trial in the so-called cipher case that pertains to a diplomatic document. The Federal Investigation Agency alleges that it was never returned by Imran Khan. The PTI has long held that the document contained a threat from the United States to unseat Imran Khan as Prime Minister. Despite the prospect of facing jail in the case, Imran Khan looked undeterred. Responding to a question, Imran Khan said, and I quote, I will not do a deal, neither will I surrender, will prefer dying in jail than going out of the country, unquote. Khan also said he would get Pakistan's former military chief, General Kamar Bajwa, and the United States embassy officials summoned to the court to testify in the case. Imran Khan added that he would accept election results if they are free and fair. Imran and former Foreign Minister Shah Mahmood Qureshi were first indicted in the Cypher case on October 23rd. Their trial is being held at the Adiala jail. Four witnesses have recorded their statements. While the fifth was being cross-examined, an Islamabad High Court bench termed the jail trial as erroneous and scrapped the proceedings. At the hearing, Qureshi urged the special court to summon President Dr. Arif Alvi on whether he approved the changes in the Official Secrets Act 1923. Six members of the media were allowed to cover the proceedings. The special court ruled that Imran Khan and Qureshi will be indicted in the case again on December 12th. In a first since 5th of August, since his arrest, Imran Khan spoke to reporters inside the Adyala prison during the ongoing cipher case trial. Imran Khan looks undeterred and refuses to bore down on the narrative that he had created something that can be a cause of concern for his opposition. Meanwhile, the cipher case indictment has been deferred up until the 12th of December. Along with Imran Khan, the former Foreign Minister Shah Mahmood Qureshi will also be indicted in the case. Anas Malik, Islamabad, Pakistan for Beyond World is One.